Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello Indonesia. My name is Nurakila Awal. I'm representative of mahasiswa berprestasi from Poltekkes Kemenkes Makassar. National selection in 2021. I'm 20 years old and I'm in the sixth semester of nutrition department in Poltekkes Kemenkes Makassar. institution for professional in health sector under the auspices Ministry of Health in Republic of Indonesia. There are eight departments in Poltekkes Kemenkes Makassar which are Medical Laboratory Technology Department, Pharmacy Department, Nursing Department, Midwifery Department, Dental Health Department, Environmental Health Department, Physiotherapy Department, and Nutrition Department. For almost three years, I studied at Nutrition Department in Poltekkes Kemenkes Makassar. I know that, in fact, there was a lot of things that we could learn, such as from health, nutrition, and education. And all of this, more I learned about it, more I interest on it. To further develop the knowledge I've gained, I have participated in one several competitions, which are the first winner of Islamic Medicine Scientific Competition and Book Review for Public Pastor Competition in 2019. Second winner of Sky Nitrum for that the contest in 2021. Second Consolation Prize winner of Even Nutrition Creative Competition 1.0 for Recipe Modification in 2020. Third winner of Sandy Karsa Pharmacy Cup 9 for Speech Competition in 2019. I have also joined as a member in Kominfo Division in 2019 and Vice Chairman in 2020, Nutrition HMJ for Tekes Kemenkes Makassar and carried out several community services such as kelas belajar OKI, posyandu binaan, panti asuhan binaan, and berbagi kasih. And Alhamdulillah, after taking part in the selection, I was chosen and interested as representative of mahasiswa berprestasi. And on this opportunity, I will promote and present Poltekkes Kemenkes Makassar. Talking about nutrition nowadays, as we know that best nutrition comes from food. But the simple question that always appears in our head is, is this food delicious? Is it good? Is it right? And is it enough? The nutrition comes and appear to answer every question about it and give the best solution for the question by giving a counseling and creating a healthy food. One of my ambitions to become a nutritionist is I want to become a nutritionist who will take a part to help some groups in our society who need special nutrition needs, such as children with autism. Until now, in Indonesia there is no research on the exact number of autistic individuals. However, based on World Health Organization data, the prevalence of autism in Indonesia has increased rapidly compared to 10 years ago from 1 for 1,000 population to 8 for 1,000 population. This figure even exceeds the world safe average of 6 for 1,000 population. Another study explained that from 200 million people in Indonesia, the number of children with autism reached 150 to 200,000 children. Autism Spectrum Disorder is a group of brain development disorders characterized by stereotypical behavior and deficits in communication and social interaction. Metabolic condition in autism children which include increased intestinal permeability or leaky gut and imperfect digestive enzymes such as dipeptidylpeptidase 4 can result in the typical symptoms of autism. Symptoms include sleep deprivation, unfocus or frequent daydreaming, aggressive behavior, and self-harm. Therefore, autism children are advised to go on gluten-free and casein-free diet. Gluten and casein in its consumed by autism children are not completely digested and produce peptidase or 
exorphins. These peptidase can enter to the bloodstream and bind to the brain and produce the autism symptoms. With this problem, I offer a simple solution by creating a gluten-free, casein-free cookies and I call it as Tensive Cookies. Why do I choose cookies? Because cookies are one type of snack that is very easy to make. And of course, children really like this kind of snack. The ingredients that I use in these cookies are gluten and casein tree. The first ingredient is mocha flour. Mocha flour is rich in micronutrients such as calcium, iron, phosphorus, and fiber, and it's easier to digest. Mung bean flour has a high content of protein and minerals. Moringa leaf is called as functional food that is rich in calcium, vitamin E, vitamin A, and vitamin C. In making these cookies, I will fortify moringa leaf flour so it will not change the organoleptic characteristic of the cookies. The use of these ingredients is not only rich in micronutrients that can improve memory and cognitive abilities of children with autism. These ingredients are also very easy to find because they are local Indonesian food. Other ingredients such as margarine, sugar, palm sugar, egg, vanilla essence, and salt are still used as the basic recipe for making cookies. Roast the cashews until cooked, grate it hoarsely, then set aside. Mix margarine, sugar, and palm sugar until evenly distributed by using a mixer. Add the egg and vanilla, then mix again. Mix mocha flour, mung bean flour, and moringa leaf flour, then stir using a sieve. Mix all materials together using a mixer until smooth to form a dough. Use a tablespoon to form the dough into a round shaped cookie. Pierce it with a fork and garnish with roasted cases. Place the round shaped cookies on the pan. Sprinkle a little salt on top of the cookie and bake it for 25 minutes in 165 degrees Celsius. Remove the cookies out from the oven once it cooked. Cool it in the room temperature. Cookies are ready to be served and be packaged. After testing the acceptability of cookies by conducting organolytic tests, as a result from the color aspect is 60% with light category. And the highest percentage was obtained in the aspect of scent, texture, taste, and maturity level with very light category. Stop COVID-19 pandemic by still adhering to health protocol by wearing masks, washing hands, maintaining distance, and stay at home. Perfection just come from Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. Shortcomings and mistakes just come from me. Thank you so much for watching my video. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.